I think it's how do we bring that technology together into a product experience. I think that's where the industry is headed. And I think we're just at the beginning of seeing that happen. Throw me a kiss from across the room. Tell me I look nice even when I'm not. Today's cars are getting a lot of technology in them and connectivity is one of the key things. And I think what's really interesting about what's happening right now is you have a lot of different kinds of technology coming all at the same time into the cars. You have the connectivity, but you also have electrification, you have more sensors that allow driving, and you have different kinds of connectivity to the ecosystem, like people's phones and, and homes and those kinds of things. And all of that is coming together to create a new kind of experience. And we think that's going to change the driving experience in and around the car. So it's very important for us to consider how do we bring value to the customer with all of that technology coming in. I was Um, what we're hearing is that people want more and more features, right? They're seeing value in some of these assisted driving features. How can we help them drive more safely? How can we help people park more safely? This car has some of those features. It's really exciting. They want their content and media with them, right? They want to get into the car and have a driving route, uh, their music enabled. So that kind of connectivity helps make that happen. What we do is we seek out partners that are really excellent in their field to help provide a capability that we're looking for. To make the screens very responsive, we have Snapdragon technology in there to, you know, when you're using the touchscreen, it quickly renders, it scrolls really quickly, it responds to touch very quickly. That's very important when you're driving to create a safe experience. Right, we partner with Google because they bring this world of applications and technology like Google Maps and Voice Assistant into the car that they can do at a, at a very large scale. So we're letting them be experts in their field and we're bringing that technology together into the driving experience where we think we can add the most value. So peace, so sweet, so beautiful. To bring those experiences to life, we need the people that have the skills and talent to do that. And so we've been expanding that capability. We obviously have a tech hub in Sweden. We have one in Gothenburg and actually in Stockholm as well, um, bringing in some really great talent that we find there. We've recently opened one up in Poland. So bringing in some uh, software development talent that we know is in that area. And we also recently announced Singapore. You know, we think those areas are attractive for the kinds of skills that we need to bring in and enhance the skills that we already have within the company. Big things have small beginnings. So let me introduce you to something huge. I think it's how do we bring that technology together into a product experience. I think that's where the industry is headed. And I think we're just at the beginning of seeing that happen. We've started with electrification. I think we have a long way to go actually for us to realize the capabilities that that brings. Uh, you know, we've done some interesting things in, in, the, in the product that electrification allows us to make the interior bigger. We can keep the climate on longer without emitting carbon emissions, uh, making it safer for everyone. And I think more capabilities will come, but that's just electrification. As you take the electrification, as you take the sensor sets, as you take the connectivity, all of these things are combined are going to do something that's really interesting. And we're just at the beginning of, of that journey, and that's why I'm really excited to work on projects like this. Mm -hmm.